Hey guys, I'm John. Today we're here at the Mishimoto Garage to install the Mishimoto Direct Fit Aluminum Coolant Expansion Tank for the 2015 Plus Ford Mustang EcoBoost V6 and V8. If you haven't done so already, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more exclusive Mustang content. If you're looking to add some additional style to your engine bay, now is a great time to install the Mishimoto Direct Fit Silicone Coolant Hoses, offered in black, blue, and red. Let's get started on the install. Tools needed for install include 5.5, 7, and 10 millimeter deep sockets, quarter drive ratchet, flathead screwdriver, angled needle nose pliers, post clamp vice grips, a funnel, and Mishimoto's Liquid Chill Synthetic Engine Coolant. Install time is about one hour, and install difficulty is a two out of five. Raise your Mustang up by either using a lift or a jack and jack stands. Remove the 14 7mm bolts, 6 pop clips, and two 5.5mm bolts holding the under tray in place. Attach a hose to the petcock on the bottom of the stock radiator. We're going to drain some of the coolant from your cooling system in order to remove your stock Mustang expansion tank. Remove the cap on the stock expansion tank to aid in the draining process. Using needle nose pliers, Remove the spring clip from the front port on the expansion tank. Using those needle nose pliers again, remove the one spring clip from the back port facing your engine on the expansion tank. Once both spring clips are removed, use the needle nose pliers to remove both the hoses from the stock expansion tank. Using a 10 mm deep socket, remove the two 10 mm bolts holding the stock expansion tank to the plastic fan shroud at the top of the radiator. Next. Use your needle nose pliers to remove the one spring clip on the hose going into the bottom of the stock tank. If you want to make sure no coolant runs out of your hose, clamp it down with vice grip hose clamp pliers before removing the hose. Make sure to place one provided warm gear clamp onto this hose before installing the Mishimoto expansion tank. Slide the bottom port of the Mishimoto tank onto the hose with the worm gear clamp. Tighten the clamp using a flathead screwdriver. Before tightening down the expansion tank, Make sure that the angled mount seats down into the plastic hole on the stock fan shroud. Using a 10mm deep socket, tighten down your Mishimoto Mustang expansion tank using the two provided 10mm bolts. Place a worm gear clamp on the hose that connects to the port on the back of the expansion tank and tighten it using a flathead screwdriver. On the front side of your expansion tank, Place a worm gear clamp on the hose that connects to the port on the front and tighten it using a flathead screwdriver. Connect the last hose to the overflow nipple on the fill neck and route it down towards the holes on the lower radiator support for proper drainage. Reattach the stock expansion tank cap onto your new Mishimoto expansion tank. Go ahead and reattach the under tray using the 14 7mm bolts, 6 pop clips, and two 5.5mm bolts you removed earlier. To finish up the install, make sure the hose which attaches to the overflow nipple on the fill neck is routed down towards the holes on the lower radiator support. Now we're ready to fill and bleed the cooling system. For that, we're going to use Mishimoto's Liquid Chill Full Synthetic Coolant. Also, don't forget to click subscribe and like us on Facebook.